Hello, this is Susan Smith Nash, and we're going to talk about the evaluation essay, tips and guidelines, how to get started. First of all, an evaluation essay helps you put the thing that you're looking at into some kind of qualitative context. So you might be comparing it to something else, contrasting it, listing its attributes, sizing it up, but it's always about quality. So if you are looking at quality, you definitely want to know how the, how the criteria are selected. So both, basically they usually settle or in, settle on or around, um, so it kind of orbits around attributes. So here let's take a look at a surfboard coated with nano resin. It was developed in Honolulu by Oceanet and tried out on the North Shore, Waikiki, and Kailua. The evaluation essay steps. Select a thing, place, or event to evaluate. Use a photo to trigger your thoughts, provide a topic. Clearly define what you are evaluating, so use a paragraph to define it. Tell its basic essence. Um, step back. Why? Why are you evaluating? Why are you evaluating this thing, place, event, concept? What's the purpose? Then give a bit of background, um, some context, some history, if you will. Then list the key attributes, and those are, are the things that you will use as guidelines. Make sure that you include the important ones, and then as you focus on the quality and how these, um, how these attributes kind of contribute to the overall essence of the thing that you're looking at, take a moment to contemplate deeper philosophical implications. And then finally, create a conclusion that's interesting and that looks to the future and also touches your life. So I hope that this has been helpful. Let's take a look at a photograph. This is a photograph I'm going to use as a prompt or a trigger for my evaluation essay. I took this photograph in the um, north shore of Oahu, Oahu, Hawaii. It was like a spectacular day. I had just stopped and bought some coconut, fresh coconut from a, co um, a guy selling coconuts um, on the side of the road. He cut them open and so he said, coconut water. So I drank the water. Then I said, hey, can I have the coconut meat? He goes, sure. So I, I gulped it down, chomped, scarfed it down. It was really great. So anyway, um, now I'm having to take a look at this photograph and thinking, what is it that I'm evaluating? Am I evaluating the nanoparticles and the nano resin in the surfboard? Hmm, maybe. <laughs> Am I evaluating the surfboard itself, or the surf, or the experience itself? I just need to make a, a decision in my own mind as I move forward, and I can change as I go. I just w will need to make sure that my um, essay is coherent. So I hope, this is, I hope that this has been helpful. This is Susan Smith-Nash, and you're listening to some tips on writing.